Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Dinkum. Um, I was just heading out, kind of in the central area of my island, getting ready to look for Ted Selly. I don't think he shows up until afternoon, right? Um, but anyway, I started recording because look, it rained in game yesterday, and we're in a deserty area, and this is one of the new flowers that was added. The desert pea. This was added with the light, the latest update. So I saw two of them here, I thought, heck, let's go ahead and get those. Um, I've played through, I think, almost an, yeah, almost a full week since the last episode. I didn't do a whole lot. I went into the mines once just to get some stocked up on some resources. And I started getting everything we need. I think I've got everything we need for the bat sapper. But I'm so dumb <laughs> because I forgot it's Sunday and I can't go into the bank. So I only have 125,000 dinks on me. I think the zapper is 100,000. So I can't have anything else crafted because I just don't have enough money with me. So maybe we'll look for Ted again tomorrow because I do still have the materials for the battle shovel. Um, I don't think I talked about the alpha weapons or even showed them to you on the last episode, but I don't have all the resources for those either. I've had a very slow week as far as quests go with um, the alpha animals. I only had one for the alpha jack and it only dropped one antler and you need two antlers. And then there's another one that drops like an alpha scale, I think, or something like that. You need two of those. So I'm guessing that's the alpha croco. And then another one I think calls for two alpha eyes. Um, I did get a moo saddle when we were down in the mines, though, or when I was down in the mines. So if we find a moo, I'm going to put a saddle on it and try and ride it home. But yeah, I just wanted to start recording. Oh, and we've got our chainsaw. I grabbed that out of the mailbox. We had Franklin craft that for us on the last episode. Oh, that's so great. I wanted to try that out. So fun. So, um, let's see if we can get lucky and find uh, Ted Selly around here somewhere. If not, we'll just have to try again tomorrow. Also, I had a second quarry made and I moved put it as well as the other quarry that was up by the northern tower I put him at that tower there actually we can make our way over there while we're looking for Ted um, just because it's just easier to get to them from it, it's a lot closer to the tower base so I have to be kind of quiet because I want us to try and find Ted I think he should be anywhere around here. Oh, I just love the new... What are they called? Frillies? I don't remember. I just... They're so cute. I want to have them just run around with me. I'm not going to kill anymore. I had to kill a bunch just to get... I do have enough, right? Yeah, I think I need only three of the thunder sacks. Hopefully the zapper lasts or can be recharged because I don't want to have to kill a whole lot of frillies. Who <laughs> did make more? They're too cute. I just want to have them come follow me around. Oh, it's such a large map. I never know the best plan of attack. I think we'll just keep heading west towards that tower to check the quarries. And then maybe we'll zip like n back east and north. I, I don't know. Do a big zigzag and I know I for, oh we should oh it's Sunday I want to talk to Franklin we got the license for flying vehicles I know it's gonna be expensive I'm sure to have crafted but see if we can have Franklin make us a helicopter or whatever it is we get I should be looking for more flowers too while we're running around But they're very pretty, so I'm going to put them... I have one I found on the day it was raining. Let's just peek around for Ted around here a bit. Um, so I put it in the planter to see if it'll spread. Or at least I think I did. <laughs> I don't know. I was going to. I might not have yet. <clears throat> oh, more flowers. Cool. We can add these to the planners at the museum. Come on, Ted. I want to get at least one thing crafted today. 
This is why I probably should have just waited till Monday. We'll just enjoy the lovely, happy music <laughs> while running around. I have my speakers up loud enough. I should hear him. God, I love that boogie board. So fun. And you guys, while we're running around and everything, looking for Ted today, I want to thank you again to all of you who've subscribed, all of you who've been leaving comments and hitting that like button. Not only did we hit 500 subscribers last week, which meant that my husband had to finally play Stardew Valley with me. Oh, for half a second I thought I heard a whistle. Nope. Um, so we recorded that over the weekend. I'm recording this episode Monday, October 10th. I think I'm going to upload this for later today. Um, so yeah, Saturday, my husband played Stardew Valley with me. He didn't love it. I thought he would love it. He loved my time at Portia. And I'm like, how can somebody who enjoyed my time at Portia not like Stardew Valley? But it's the graphics, I think. So he did say, though, because then yesterday... Oh, yeah, here are my uh, quarries. Oh, yeah, I did just, just check them. I forgot I checked them in-game yesterday. So not much around them yet. We're going to let these go for, like, four days, and then we'll check again. Um, let's go to the North Tower and then run south. He did, so I was, I was a little bummed yesterday, and he's like, hey, what's the matter? And I said, uh, I just realized I don't have anything to look forward to. And he's like, what do you mean? I said, well, I was so excited about hitting 500 subscribers so you would play Stardew Valley with me, and now that that's done, I, I don't have anything else I'm looking forward to. <laughs> I was like a kid at Christmas Saturday. I was so excited. I was bouncing up and down. Um, yeah, we'll run and then head south. Um, he said, all right, if you hit 750 subscribers, I'll record something else with you. So I'm thinking if we could get to 750, how far is the land from here? All right, we're boogie boarding it. He says, if you can get to 750, I'll record. So I'm thinking maybe instead of Stardew Valley, we'll try and get him to play some Dinkum. I still may try and get him to do it. Like when he says, what do you want to do for your birthday? Which is coming up soon. My birthday's, um, gosh, just like uh, a week and a half away? Two weeks away? Two weeks away. <laughs> Sorry, two weeks away. Um, I might say, I'd sure love to play some Dinkum with you. <laughs> and, uh, you know, we'll, we'll see if that'll get him to play. Otherwise, if you haven't subscribed yet, do so. <laughs> Get my husband to play some more games with me. I have so much fun. He's the one who got me into gaming anyway. Yeah, we're just not having much luck with Ted Selly today, are we? I'm seeing lots of flowers. I've seen a few dig spots. Oh, hello, birdie. Don't get... Oh, gosh, you guys. <gasps> There's eggs. Oh, I'm going to ignore your eggs right now. I'm on a mission with Ted. <laughs> Gotta find Ted. I really wanted to go down in the mines tomorrow, but looks like we're just going to be searching for Ted again. Mm, I think we have one of those dragonflies. Well, there's our teleporter. Um, <laughs> man. Maybe we'll just run home. Some days, I it's like I find him right away. Some days, I never find where he's hiding. I know the weather doesn't matter. I just believe it's any time after 12 p.m. I can look for more flowers. Did I check this area over here? I did. I remember... Oh, back off, Croco. I'm having a bad day. <laughs> I 
Mm-mm-mm. Well, yeah, we're just gonna have to try again. I'm not teleporting though, I'm just gonna run. <laughs> oh, you guys, tomorrow that game Coral Island is being released. I know I've been looking forward to checking it out. I think some of you are interested in it as well. So I am going to do bright and early in the morning or as soon as it's available on Steam. Get it downloaded and installed and I'll uh, record a few episodes tomorrow that I'll space out throughout the week. We'll see how we like it. Fortunately, I recorded a whole bunch of like Disney Dreamlight Valley and Hoko Life last week. And I've been alternating the days that those go up. So, yeah, no Ted Sully for us today. Um, <clears throat> um, I have those going up through the week already. I don't need to record any of those for a few more days. So we can kind of focus on Dinkum, check out Coral Island. I do also want to do some more of my time at Sandrock. Unfortunately, that series just isn't doing very well on my channel. Oh, I did go when I went into the mines. Sorry, got distracted. So yeah, it Sandrock isn't doing very well on my channel, but I really enjoy the game. So I'm probably going to record some of, some more of that this week to put up. Um, I got a glow bug when I went down into the mines uh, when I wasn't recording. I remembered to take my net. I have a donation for you, Theodore. Have a glow bug. I sold a couple too, but I honestly, I don't remember what they sold for. Uh, take it. There you go. That's all. It's still early. Do I have my fishing rod? I do. I know we had a message that there were fish in the southern o ocean. Although, you know what? It's getting a little late. Maybe we should just see if we can help anybody tonight. Hi, Clover. What's up? We're just going to say hi. You always take some time in your day to come and talk to me. I really appreciate that, you know? So thanks. Thank you, Clover. Oh, was Sally here again today? She is. I have not been able to get her deed yet. I have a feeling we have to get her to like two hearts. Oh, I never caught anything with this trap either. <laughs> I forgot this was here. I did catch one of the, with, uh, catch a magpie with the other trap I had. Oh, she's going to be out and about. Oh, she's just standing in the water. Okay. Hi, Sally. Some scary things come out at night. Yeah, like crocos. You shouldn't be standing in the water. Hair is like nat nature's clothing. And just like clothes, the way you style it can show off your personality. Let's see if we can do a favor for her. I should have asked her earlier in the day. All right, I'm going to try because I think they're more of a nighttime. If I don't do it, though, we're going to lose a heart. Uh, let's check our Pedia. Well, yeah, we do have a section for... Have we always had the critter section? Or was that mixed in with fish before? Or was it not showing? I don't even remember now. Okay, yeah, nighttime. Habitat is anywhere. I know I've seen them flying around at night around our house and stuff. So let's let's try and get that for Sally. Because then maybe that'll get us to where she'll move in. Might even have a moth. No, nope, butterfly. I think that's a butterfly. Milburn, you're in my way. Yeah, it looks like a butterfly. It's all right. It's on the ground. Oh, a feather. Oh, so did the birds just even randomly drop feathers now? Interesting. I don't know if we'd have better luck fighting the moths around areas where we have lights. Oh, and I didn't show you guys. I got a baby, another baby vombat. So we have, um, I think Valerie was the newest. She's all grown up now. But now we also have little Daniela. <laughs> So, okay, two of them didn't eat today. And I know that those are facing the right direction. Let's just double check. So frustrating. My pleeps aren't always eating in either. 
see arrows facing towards me. Arrows facing towards me. So I, I don't know. I keep meaning to look this up. I'll go to the Discord or the Steam discussion pages. Let's try and find that moth. And see if other people have commented on it. See, yeah, see ne neither one of them ate. And they have plenty of room around their dishes. I made sure they are facing the correct direction. I'm tempted to fence off their water so they can't get to it. Maybe we'll do that. Um, come on, moth. And see if uh, they'll eat their food if they can't get to their water. Oh, I see these moths almost every night around here. I don't want to disappoint Sally. See if we can force them to spawn. If we capture the other bugs that are around, maybe a moth will spawn. Plus, we'll have things to sell in the morning. Oh, still getting some pumpkins. Right, that's right. We're on the first, first of winter already. Oh, and I crafted more... Um, more of the scarecrows. I, I did the watermelon and the pumpkin type. I was having the birds. They are so obnoxious now. As I was planting the sugar cane, the birds were coming and picking the seeds up while I was still planting. So you definitely need your scarecrows now. <laughs> That's a new thing with since the update. They didn't seem to mess with my crops before. They do now. Big time. Okay, let's hope this gets a moth to spawn. <laughs> I can catch it. Oh no, that's okay. We got it. I'm being as lame as I am in Hoko life. I am the worst bug catcher in Hoko life. Well, I, uh, I really don't want to lose any of my hearts with Sally. I mean, no big deal. She shows up like every other day. just keep hoping to find a moth. I'm going where there's lights because that just seems to make sense to me. Man, I let the biggest moth into our house not that long ago. <laughs> it made me sad we didn't have a cat anymore because I could always count on the cats to catch them when I did. Ugh. Duchess, our, one of our dogs, Cockroach, she's pretty good about going after bugs if she sees them. Our other dog, Prince, will just barely even acknowledge they're around. Mm, let's get some poop. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm losing my voice. Yeah, I started to move some more mud around. It's on the other side of the habitat. I'm going to bring in more mud, fill in over here. Because I think it'd really, really look cute to have some mangroves. Oh, are you a moth? No, you're a... Uh, a, 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 a yeah, firefly. My pockets are full. Just release it. Let's go put these flowers in a planter box, at least one of them. I still haven't harvested my fruit. The helmet's charged. Yeah, okay, we've got plenty of you. Oh yeah, duh, I just said my pockets are full. Oh, that requires more poo. <laughs> um, I'll put my pumpkin in here for now. Put that in there so now we can pick stuff up. So we'll put you away. Hello, I could pick you up too. Let's put you away. We'll put one of you. Yep, yeah, no, we'll put two of you away. So let's just put you at the end here and hopefully we'll get these to spawn in on the empty spots. Oh, I really want to find that moth. I don't want to go to bed till we do. I'm really trying to force them to spawn. I, I find them around my village all the time. And I usually just run right on by them. I'm hoping if getting the other bugs... You know how respawn works. Or forced spawn. You guys have been playing games. You know what I'm talking about. Didn't go look for a doghouse today. It's the one day I didn't go look for it. I bet it was there. I've looked like every single day that I've been playing and I've not had any luck getting the kennel for Doggo. Well, 
guess we're just gonna have to risk the loss of a heart. Let's say hi to Fletch. How's it going, Fletch? Need text. <laughs> okay, Fletch. You work on that. <laughs> oh, gotta do fences. And yes, I'm gonna say that every single time I play until I actually do fences. Well, heck. Let's just go to bed. No moth. I'm so sorry, Sally. I thought I could do it. At least I can take some money out of the bank. We'll sell the bugs we have on us. Grab money out of the bank. Grab the other stuff I need for the battle shovel. I know I don't have the materials for an alpha weapon yet. So what I'll do is in between episodes, probably just try to farm some of that. Maybe we'll get lucky and there's a new quest today for one. Oh, we've got corn ready. We've got another pumpkin ready. Let's... I probably can't harvest you, can I? Oh yeah, I can. Put our fertilizer away. So, also, if you go down in the mine, start saving your bat wings. I'm gonna give you a little spoiler. That in addition, I'd heard that there's a new profitable seed and did a little reading and learned that it is a seed you find down in the mines. I haven't found it yet. I did run into a statue. <laughs> so, of course I had to research what the statue was for. You want to have, I think it's 20 bat wings to give to this statue and you get a really cool item. I'm not going to tell you guys what it is. I'm just giving you that much of a spoiler. Just a little tease. I only have like nine bat wings. I don't have enough. Oh yeah, we gotta go find a moo to put the saddle on. All right, just let's let's just keep our hands empty. Um, I'll harvest corn in a bit. Oh, we got another pumpkin ready over here. So apparently pumpkins still grow. No, the plants have died. Okay, because yeah, we are in winter. I wondered about that. So, but it looks like the pumpkins that started to sprout might actually finish. I'm going to leave them alone to do their thing. See if they finish growing. Uh, yeah, go sell bugs. Get money out of the bank. Feed our animals and stuff, and then we'll go look. We'll grab stuff out of storage that I need. Oh, alpha bush devil. Okay, cool. That'll give us, hopefully, at least one of the drops we'll need. Let's see where he is. Okay, oh, perfect. Right close to the tower. Anything I want to sell? Banded Morwong. We'll leave the shoes. Have I donated one of those? Oh my god! Hit the right button, you fool. <laughs> yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, so we'll just sell it. Nice. Oh, I think we can cook fish now, right? Was that added in the update? Um, I'm not going to try it with this fish, but I'll try it with some others if we end up doing a little fishing while we're running around looking for Ted. Yeah, you can have those. You can't have anything else. Thanks, John. But yeah, if we get just some kind of basic, cheap, regular old fishies. Let's put you down on the toolbar. Let's move you guys around. Let's have our shovel handy. Okay. Shh, that is so loud. Um, money. What time does the bank open? Okay, good. Uh, show me my account. See, I'd put money away so I wouldn't lose much if anything bad happened to me in the mines. Let's take out like 400. All right, so that still leaves us with 1.1 in the bank. 530 some on us. Let's see, rain, not going to be open yet. Irwin's not going to be open yet. Flowers haven't spread yet. We'll see if they do. 
Um, so yeah, I'm going to grab these. I'm going to grab everything I... Okay, this stuff can be put away. I'm going to put, put away stuff down here. Because <laughs> if I get overcrowded inventory, my brain gets overcrowded. <laughs> okay, yeah, you can go away as well. Wait, I do need you. I'm holding on to my mind pass. I don't know why. Um, we needed the resin. We needed our croco teeth. Yeah, I only have nine bat, bat wings. I only have one alpha antler. I only have four opals. I think I need five for each of the alpha weapons. Okay. I think that's everything we need for the, the battle shovel. I think. Copper, resin, teeth, shovel. I think it was just the four items and money. Um, get that out of the... Oh yeah, and a spare shovel. So do I have two shovels on me? Yes, I do have two shovels on me. Let's feed Doggo. We'll worry about our other animals later. <laughs> They're fed. That's all that matters right now. Hi, Doggo. Have a little steaky steak. What a good Doggo. We're going to run into Irwin's store, see if we can find the kennel. I think once we do find the kennel, my plan is to remove these, this fencing right here, just to expand the Vombat area to make it really big. And we're gonna move Doggo to our front yard. Hi, one minute to work, please. Oh wait, it's Monday. Dang it. Yeah, you're closed today. I should probably get some seeds to plant. She doesn't open till 11. You guys drive me nuts with your hours of operation. Let's go do... I've got food. I've got weapons. Let's go do the uh, alpha. Let's track it. Ooh, there's a shark out there. Bush devil. We're doing a bush devil for Milburn. Cool. We haven't done much for Milburn, so that's nice. Hi, shark. <laughs> Hello, pick the tower, not the actual animal. <laughs> you can tell I was playing on my Switch. You can always tell when I go back. Well, okay, I'm always kind of lame anyway. <laughs> but I mix up my buttons on the controllers when I've been playing games on the Switch. Oi! He is up and mad. Let's get our little health and energy buff. <laughs> running no he's gonna get me not your fishing pool you fool oh that's right he does that big aoe why am i not stabbing him Oi! <laughs> he got me that time i kind of like staying behind him for when he does that aoe it's awful Oh, good. I harvested some grass. <laughs> oh, and more. So, yeah, standing behind him, definitely. Oh, seems to be help. Well, it was helping. <laughs> now we got to get to a different area because he's getting, he's getting crazy flamey. Let's eat a little food. Oh, is he not following me? Oh, he probably could. Could he not get down? Hopefully he didn't regen all the way. I don't think they do. I just wanted to get out of the fire hazard. Yeah, we've almost got him. Oy, oh, I ran right into it. Cool. That was just harder to fight up on that weird landscaping. I think he's going to drop like an eye or something. Oh, right into it. It's all right. We're fine. He's almost down. 
got him. Okay. Yeah, he drops an alpha eye. I need two eyes for one of the weapons. So. That's helpful. It's a start. I just wanted to unplink it. Plink. Um, so let's see. Let's just head... I guess start heading west and north-ish. We'll turn this in eventually when we get home. I mostly just wanted to be able to get the eye so we can start collecting the materials for the weapons. Let's see. Ted should be showing up in about three minutes, I think, somewhere. That was my inventory. A little full because I forgot to put things away. As usual. I'm not going to grab flowers. Boy, I caught myself on fire a lot with that fight. <laughs> Definitely could have done better. Because of course I would get stuff stuck up there. There, made some steps. Except I put the shiny stone in there, didn't I? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right. Come on, Ted. Let's go a little further. We'll go over. We'll go east. And then we'll start making our way north. Try to have a little plan of attack. Oh, don't wake up. Keep sleeping. He does not want to be found. We could even sell him any animal drops, except not our eye. <laughs> I mean, let's run over here just in case. I wonder, maybe some of you know, is it better, because Ted buys animal parts and drops in the meat and stuff, is it better to sell those kinds of things to him? Or do we get more money if we sell it in stacks of 50 to Jimmy? Who gives us a better return? I haven't played with that, so I don't know. <gasps> there he is! I'm <laughs> really excited. <laughs> Hi. I'm hoping I have everything I need. <laughs> I do want... I, I want to have you make some things. So let's do the bat zapper first. We've got everything. I'm so excited. Our bat zapper. Pretty good, eh? Yeah, look at him. He's so proud of himself. Uh, let's see if we can do something else. I'll show you guys the alpha weapons because I forgot. Oh, that does 22 damage. It needs two antlers. I have one. Iron hammer. It is five opals. So five opals. Copper and iron ore. Um, I kind of want to get the sphere. Or, uh, sphere. Oh my god. The spear. I really like hunting with a spear in this game. So I'm kind of wanting... I need the alpha croc so we can get the scales. So that again takes 10 of each of those two ores plus five opals. The bat takes the two eyes. We only have one so far. That would be fun too. I actually really want to try that out. I gotta get better at using the hammers. Um, but I think we can do a battle shovel. We can. <laughs> I'm scared he was gone. Um, all done. Um, I, let's see what he would pay us for. Um, our, our, our prime meat. Mm, no deal for now. I'm going to hold on to it and see. So it was 9900 for the two. We'll see what maybe Jimmy would offer if I ever have a stack of 50. 
Oh, you guys don't even know how excited I am. I kind of want to go in the mines, but it's sort of early in the day. Oh, I do. We could use our battle shovel, though. See how it works. Hold on a second. play with this little guy. Sorry. Put you on fire. I want to go find something else to try out our shovel on. Actually, I want to try it on something without setting it on fire. Well, we'll head this way. There's usually stuff to, to hunt. And maybe we'll find a moo while we're out running around that we can put the saddle on. Hi, Jackaroo. Don't mind me. Just running here with a little spiky shovel. <laughs> okay, that was fun. See, it's fast. You didn't feel a thing. Hi, Croco. Come here. Hello. Okay, we'll swim over. If you're going to play that way. I've never noticed them growl before. That's cool. Come on. Mm, you still take a few hits. I think it's less hits if I hit him with the flaming bat first. Catch him on fire. Oh, <laughs> is there a shark? I almost said, is there a whale? Hi. Yeah, I'm not going to... Yeah, a flaming bat on a shark in the water. It's just going to put him out right away. Well, here's our teleporter. Hi, doggo. Sorry. Yeah, that was pretty fast. I don't like his howl, though. That made me feel a little mean. Um... Yeah, before I wrap it up, I do want to see if we can find a moo. We'll go down into the mines on the next episode. Where do I usually find them? I mean, I find them anywhere. I feel like I find them more in deserty areas. Let's try our battle shovel on you. Oh, wow. Yeah. Those two combined. That's kind of fun. I'll have fun with that down in the mines. Um... <laughs> She's so cute. She's so proud of herself with her little shovel. I feel like I'm just going to run in circles and not really find one. to get this copper while we're here. <laughs> Chainsaw makes kind of a rude noise. <laughs> well, we'll get a moo next time. Let's head home and turn in our quest. There we go. Um, we will put... Our alpha eye away. Let's find Milburn. Bank should be closing, I would think, by now. Okay, you need to go away. I'm going to get you with my shovel. Oh, so fast. I mean, it's rude. Sorry, kangaroo. Is the bank still open? No. Did that just say read? There we go. Closed. That's handy. Thank you. There he is. Uh, I did that thing for you, Milburn. You're welcome. They are dangerous. 33,000 dinks. Heck yeah. Thanks. Woohoo. Um, hi, Rain. We haven't said hi to you in a bit. What's new? You see so much from high up in an airship but like you don't get to really connect with anything oh we forgot to go see franklin is franklin closed yes dang it 
How late are you open? Four, right? Yeah. Just missed you. That's all right. So tomorrow, well, on the next episode, which will probably be tomorrow. I'm not planning on playing in between episodes. We'll see if we can get the dog kennel. We're going to go down into the mines and try out our bug zapper. Here it is. So that'll be exciting. Oh, it's so cute. Look at it. <laughs> I don't want to wear it down now. So anyway, you guys, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you on the next episode. Take care.